Hello, my name is Lusions, and welcome to the Nerdery-ish. As you can see, I'm in my office again, and this is going to be a loot gaming unboxing. Really interesting shape for this um, this uh, loot gaming box. It's thin and long. Okay, so let's get out the handy dandy knife. Um, I should really bring my knife from the Nerdery to work so I can use that knife. I kind of miss it. So, oh really cool. When you first open it, it looks like a chest or a crate. So, wood. So it's gaming and I forgot what the theme is. But, there is, right away, Gears of War 4. So really cool, the co the Coalition, Microsoft Studios, Loot Gaming, Power Factory. So Mark II Lancer, that is a Mark II Lancer. Oh, that is really cool. So that is, that must be the Mark II Lancer. I haven't played Gears of War, let alone Gears of War 4, but that is a really cool making sure it's not a um, USB. So it looks like there's a stand. So I'll do this up here so you can see what I'm attempting to do. Okay, that makes sense. Actually, this makes better sense. So cool little stand they put together. Um, is it on this side? Yeah, it's on this side. You can't really see it. But on the front of it, it says Gears of War 4. And dun, 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 dun. let's put it this way. And there you have it. So that's pretty cool. So it's a little replica of the Lancer 2, did I say? Mark Lancer 2. So really cool. I think I seen it in um, one of the trailers for Gears of War 4. So that's pretty cool. Whoa. So this, so Dead Rising 4, it has heft to it. Loot Crate, Capcom. So let's see, is it a deck of cards? Try to get this open without ripping it. It is pretty hefty, whatever it is has some heft to it oh whoa no way oh that is really cool so here's a pouch um, as you can see you can hook it to your belt and it says dead rising 4 on it and it is a multi-tool so it says Frank West Really cool red color. That is really cool. Suppliers. Let's see what else we got here. So we got a nail file, flathead, also a bottle opener on that. Phillips. Also looks like it can be used for something there. Um, I'm assuming, oh, it's another flathead. That is really cool. And then on this other side, let's close all that. And then on this side, oh, cool, it's a flashlight. So that's really cool. Um, I don't think there's a knife in here. I mean, I could kind of understand why. Oh, no, no. So I thought that was a knife, but it's not. It's just a uh, flathead. So they have two flathead uh, Phillips. I'm wondering if this is where the knife would have been, but I'm assuming since um, subscribers might be underage, I don't see why they wouldn't have a knife, but 
Anyway, it's really cool. I really like it. I can see myself using this at work. So really cool. I like that. That is awesome. I really like getting stuff that I can use every day. I mean, this stuff is cool, but um, yeah, that will just sit on the shelf to where this I'll actually get to use. So anyway, hopefully you guys are able to hear me. I'm trying to talk loud. I'm trying to be somewhat in a hurry because I'm at work and as you can see, it's almost eight. So what do we have here? Battle Zone. I think that is one of the one of the original video games. So Battle Zone. Loot crate on the top there. So let's get this open. Oh, <laughs> nice. They are Battle Zone shot glass shot glasses there's two of them in here so loot crate right there there's battle zone and all its vector glory and there are two of them in there so that is really cool score high score that is really freaking cool That is pretty awesome. Like I said, in all its vector glory. Oh, cool. They're different. So this one said it's battle zone. And this one has like that tank. So that is, that is really freaking cool. Um, I'm going to put these back in here. Put them back in its little pouch. That is really cool. That is awesome. This the um this is the gaming crate, loot gaming as I said in the beginning of the video. But that is really cool. Um I totally did not anticipate getting uh shot glasses, especially Battle Zone. Battle Zone 1980. Wow. A lot of you loot gamers probably weren't even born yet. I feel really old. So then the um, the uh, multi tool and the cool Mark Lancer two Gears of War f Gears of War four. Oh no! Yes and no. So Dark Souls Legends of the Flame. So we have a really cool comic book, and the reason why I said oh no. I love getting these comics. I'm starting to get a collection of these Loot Crate comics, but I am keeping them sealed. I haven't opened them. I would love to open them and read them. Um, as mentioned before in my other videos, if you have seen any, um, my son Frank likes getting Loot Crates. He's more of an anime crate guy, but the couple times he did get crates, um, he also got comic books and he tore his open right away. So I was fine with because I'm keeping mine sealed and I got to read his. But like this one and the last one I received, the Harley Quinn one, yeah, haven't opened so I haven't read it. So hopefully another looter will open it and go through it. So, oh yeah. Oh, sweet. So it looks like instead of the gaming manual, which is usually in here, unless I just didn't get one, it looks like, oh, that's awesome. So instead of the gaming manual, there's a poster. So that looks, I mean, I think it's just, it says Battleground. I'm assuming that is the theme for uh, this month's loot or gaming crate. So battleground, and there is a battleground scene. It looks very much like um, Battlefield One, uh, which is just came out or about to come out. I think the beta just ended not too long ago, 
So that is really cool. Oh, I love this. I love this. And then, so Battleground. Fierce conflicts, epic fields of war, and larger-than-life heroes are what make the franchises in this month's Battleground such a blast. This crate features exclusive collectibles and apparel from Fallout, Gears of War, Dark Rising, or Dead Rising, Dark Souls, and the retro title Battle Zone to keep you in the fight no matter what's thrown at you. So there's Dead Rising multi tool, really cool. So it includes six non blade tools, so that's fine. Um, Etch with Frank West, oh! Fallout. So the t-shirt is Fallout. Uh, I haven't gotten to that yet. And then Dark Souls Legends of the Flame number one comic. Oh, the coin. I haven't even picked, grabbed the coin yet. Battle Zone shot glasses. Battle Zone map screen. And Battle Zone game over screen. Oh, cool. Battle Zone is considered one of the first virtual reality arcade games. So it's pretty awesome that it got a remake during this current time of leaps and bounds in VR technology. Players control a tank on the field of battle, avoiding missiles and other tanks while wrecking shop. These two shot glasses feature the game over and map screen from the original Battle Zone. Then Gears of War Classic Lancer Replica. Xbox One S Epic Drop. I didn't get that. That would have been awesome. My sons would have loved that. But um, yeah, I really like that it's also a poster. So that's cool. I'll throw you back, back there. So yeah, I really like that. And here is the Battleground September 2016 pin. Try to get that here, matter of fact, let's Take it out of its shiny wrapper. Wrapper, wrapper, wrapper. It's really cool. That is awesome. So it shows a skull. He has an ace of spades emblem on his. Looks like a like a World War II type helmet. So Battleground September 2016. Really cool. And then, of course, this is the Fallout 4. That is really cool. So, Fallout 4 t shirt. So, that, that is a pretty awesome gaming crate. And if you look. If you look in here, looks like a whole bunch of M1, A1, Grands maybe, um, type looking weapons. So it's actually a weapon crate. Open it up. There's your weapons. Wow. What is that? Five, six meg. So really cool. So yeah, awesome. Um, really awesome gaming crate this month for September Battleground. But um, anyway, I hope you like this video. If, uh, if you're a gamer, if you have gamer friends or gamer loved ones, awesome gift idea. Uh, it's, really, it's really exciting getting you know stuff like this in the mail every month. Uh, they have different subscription options. You can go month by month. You can go by three months, I think six months now. Um, I did a year subscription. Um, so, yeah, really, really cool items. They packed a lot in that little thin, thin uh, crate. So, um, anyway, my name is Lusions. This has been The Nerdery, and uh, thank you for watching. Bye.